Greetings, greetings viewers and subscribers. So in today's video, we're not going to be doing any driving. We're going to be telling you about the St. James Police. 30 most wanted men. Where photographs are available, we'll be showing you their photographs. Now today, we intend on doing some more videos. Later on today, we're going to be carrying a roundup of news stories for Western Jamaica on this channel. We are also going to be carrying the birthday greetings video later on. On the other channel, Jamaica Vibes TV, we are going to be putting out a video. Now, you remember we have been telling you about Shade Foster, popularly known as Shana. She was the young lady who was found at Bastard Cedar Walk early Monday morning. She was taken out by a hoodlum. We are going to show you a video of Shade's daughter. But first, listen to this. God want me a dream, me a sleep in my bed, good, good bed, you know. And like God just wake me up and say, go look, go check by your mother and pray for her. Can't come out there. Pray for Yeah. And God, nothing good in the inner life. You just have to trust God. Don't trust Satan. Because Satan has nothing good for you. Apparently, based on her mother's lifestyle, she knew that something was gonna happen for her mother. So we are gonna show you a video of Shana, our Shade's daughter, praying for her. We are gonna be releasing that video on the other channel, Jamaica Vibes TV. So we want you to go over there and watch that video later on today. If you are subscribed, you will get the notification. If you have not yet subscribed, remember to hit on the subscribe button on Jamaica Vibes TV. Now, like we said, in this video, we are going to be talking about the St. James Police 30 Most Wanted Men. First on the list, the second person on the list is Kenroy Roach. He's popularly known as Tika. He's from Hampton District in the parish of St. James. Now, Tika is wanted for the murder of Jermaine Brown. This murder it was committed in March 2021 at Hopeton District in the parish of St. James. Tika is also considered armed and dangerous. Next up is Ainsley Woodburn. He's popularly known as Shartman and he's from Belmont District in the parish of St. James. You remember we carried a story about Shartman. He had escaped police custody under suspicious circumstances. Now, Shartman... He was in police custody for at least six counts of murder, as well as illegal possession of firearm. Next person on the list, we don't have a photograph for him, but his name is Fitzroy Jones. He's popularly known as Dapper. He's wanted for the murder of Mission Garden. Now, this murder, it was committed on May 21, 2020 at Mall Road, Roseites in the parish of St. James. Next on the list, is Odin Brown. He's popularly known as Bummy Squeeze. He's said to be in his mid 30s. He's from Hendon Narwood, Montego Bay, in the parish of St. James. Now, Bummy Squeeze is wanted for the murder of Alan Walters, popularly known as Hat Beer. This murder it was committed in March 2019 at the intersection of Forest Lane and Hendon Narwood. He's said to be of dark complexion, six feet tall. He's also big in his body. He has a round face and he's known to sport a beard. He also has a scar on his forehead. Next up, we don't have a photograph of this person either. His name is Marshall Dillon. He's popularly called Rasta or Jesus. He's from Narwood, Montego Bay, in the parish of St. James. Rasta, he's said to be about six feet tall slim built he also has a brown complexion almost looking like a white person he's known to sports a dreadlocks hairstyle he has a straight face small eyes we are told that his eyes look like a chinese eye you know let's say somebody have chinese eyes that's how his eyes look he has a straight nose thick dark lips and he has a tattoo on his right hand it is also said that rasta he walk with a skank. You know them type of long time road boy how them walk and skank? That's how Rasta walks. He's wanted for the murder of 
Kishane Harton. This murder, it was committed in Norwood, Montego Bay, from August 2013. That's how long Rasta has been wanted by the police. Next up is Romaine Tharp. Romaine is known as Dutchman. He's wanted for the murder of Rohan McCarthy, popularly known as Ratty. Ratty, he was shot and killed on the 1st of January 2020. This incident took place at Lilliput in the parish of St. James. Next up is Oran Dunn. He's popularly known as Mike. He's from Paradise Crescent, Norwood, in the parish of St. James. Mike, he's said to be 5 feet 6 inches tall. He's known to sport a cornrow hairstyle and he's of black complexion. Now, Mike is wanted for the double murder of Okan Johnson and Patmore Johnson. Both of them, both brothers, they were shot and killed in July 2017 at Paradise Crescent in Montego Bay. Next up is Leon Higgins. He's popularly known as Futa. Now, Futa is from Rosites, Montego Bay in the parish of St. James. Futa is of a black complexion but in bleach out him skin. It is said that he is of a thick built and he also sports a cornrow hairstyle. He is about 6 feet tall. He also sports a beard. His jaws are fat and he has a tattoo on his right hand. He is wanted for the murder of Jordan Black. This incident it took place in July 2018 at Rosites in the parish of St. James. Next up is Shaquille Brown. Shaquille Brown is from William Street, Montego Bay in the parish of St. James. Shaquille is about 5 feet 9 inches tall. He's of a dark complexion and he has a scar on his left cheek. He's wanted for the murder of Romario Chin, popularly known as Bigger. Now, Bigger, he was shot and killed at William Street in Montego Bay in April 2019. Next up is Joshua Anderson. He's popularly known as Josh Harledge. He's said to be a contractor and he's from Norwood, Montego Bay in the parish of St. James. He's 40 years old. He's about 5 feet 10 inches tall, slim built, bald head and he's said to be of a dark complexion. He also bleached his skin. He's wanted for the murder of a lady. This lady's name is Christine Pearl Gabriel Johnson. This incident, it took place at Jamcan Restaurant Bar and Car Wash at Bog, Montego Bay in the parish of St. James. It took place on the 5th of December, 2016. Next up is Gerald McNaughton. He's popularly known as Ice or Ice Tea. He's said to be a shopkeeper and he's from Flankers in Montego Bay in the parish of St. James. Now, Ice-T is wanted for the murder of Delroy Fisher. We carried that incident on this channel. A man was also shot and injured in that incident. It took place on November 2nd, 2021 at New Road, Providence, Flankers in the parish of St. James. Next up is Nikila Lewis. He's popularly known as Kilo. Kilo is wanted for the murder of Chevin Stevens, popularly known as Alex. Now, three other persons were also shot and injured in that incident. It was committed on January 4th, 2022 at Ocean Heights, Lilliput, in the parish of St. James. We had also carried that incident on this channel. That man on the screen is known as Cliff Henry. Cliff Henry is wanted for a murder from 2016. It is said that he shot and killed Logan Griffiths in July 2016 at Seaview Drive, Ryan Park in the parish of St. James. So he's wanted for the offense of murder. Next up is Jim Warren. He's popularly known as Tano. He's from Rentland District, Mount Carey in the parish of St. James. Tano is said to be of a dark complexion. And he's of a stout built. He's wanted by the police for the offenses of shooting with intent. Next up is Alex Scott. Now, Alex Scott is 21 years old and he's from Providence Heights in the parish of St. James. Alex Scott, he also escaped police custody in November 
with Shartman. At the time, he escaped police custody. He was being held for the offences of wounding with intent and illegal possession of firearm. Now, one day after Alex Scott escaped custody, the person who he was charged with shooting at and wounding, that person was killed. It is suspected that Alex Scott, popularly known as AJ, he may have escaped police custody and went out and shot and killed this witness. Next up is Kevin White. He's popularly known as Chucky Dan. Chucky Dan is from Yarkbush, Mount Carey, in the parish of St. James. He's wanted for the offenses of shooting with intent and illegal possession of firearm. This incident, it took place in December 2018 at Yarkbush, Mount Carey, in the parish of St. James. Next on the list is Javon Campbell. He's popularly known as Jeff or Cooking Isle. He's from Mount Salem in the parish of St. James. He's 25 years old. Jeff is of a dark complexion but him bleach out him skin. He's slim built and he's known to sport a cornrow hairstyle. He's about 5 feet 11 inches tall and he sports a lot of tattoos. He's wanted for the offenses of wounding with intent. In that incident, it took place in March 2016 at Pigot Street in Mount Salem. He's also wanted for another shooting offense. This one, it took place in April 2017 at the same Pigot Street, Mount Salem. Now, next up is James. Next up, we don't have any photograph of this person, but he goes by the name Andrew or Andrew Blacks or Crocodile. He's wanted for the offense of wounded with intent which was committed at Flower Hill in St. James from June 2016. This other person, we don't have any photograph either, but he's wanted in relation to the same incident that Andrew Blacks is wanted in. He goes by the name Tor Bennett. He's from Top Road, Roseites in the parish of St. James. Now, Tor Bennett, he's said to be of a clear complexion, medium built and about 5 feet 8 inches tall. Next up, is Caval Duncan. He's from Newtown, Flower Hill in the parish of St. James. Now, Caval is said to be about 6 feet 1 inch tall. His left hand, it is deformed at the wrist. He also sports a cornrow hairstyle. He's said to be about 31 years old. Now, Caval is also wanted for the same offense that Andrew Blacks and Tor Bennett is wanted in. This incident, it took place in June 2016 at Flower Hill in the parish of St. James. In that incident, it is said that three men shot and wounded a man. So they are wanted for that offense. This next person on your screen, his name is Daniel Gray. He's popularly called Danny or 10 4. He's 32 years old. Now, Danny is wanted for the offenses of wounded with intent and illegal possession of firearm. This is after a man was shot and seriously wounded from October 2016. This incident, it took place at Barrett Hall in the parish of St. James. Next on your list is Kevin Francis, but we don't have a photograph for him. He's popularly known as Kiki or Cody. He's from Capchalan, Pit 4 in the parish of St. James. He's about 22 years old. Now, Kiki is said to be tall slim built and he's of a dark complexion but he also bleached out his skin he's said to be straight face he has a big head and he normally sports a cornrow hairstyle kiki is wanted by the police for the offense of wounding with intent as well as illegal possession of firearm he's wanted by the police from july 2016 after he shot and wounded a man next up is davian reed davian reed he's 38 years old and his last known occupation was that of a teacher. He used to teach at the Barracks Road Primary School. Davian is wanted by the police for holding and take away. You know what that means? Yeah man, that sexual offense. He's wanted by the police from September 2015. The incident that he's wanted for, it took place at the school where he used to teach. So it is alleged that he committed the offense at the school. And from that, the police has been searching for him and can't find him. 
Next up, we don't have any photograph of this person. But he goes by the name O'Shane or Peacehead. He's wanted by the police for an offense from February 2019. This is after he shot at somebody at Bottom Road, Paradise, in the parish of St. James. Next up, we don't have any photograph of this person either, but his name is Howard Brown. It's popularly known as Gregory. He lives at Cottage Road, Kensington, in the parish of St. James. It is said that Gregory is about 47 years old. Now, Gregory is wanted for the offense of attempted murder. It is said that he almost killed a lady, and when he thought she was dead, he left. But, luckily, she survived the incident, so he is also wanted. Next up is Anson Bedward. Now, Anson Bedward, he was a security guard, and he is from Norwood, in the parish of St. James. Anson Bedward is wanted for the offense of Waldong and Tekwe. This incident, it was committed at Norwood, where he lives. But guess what? The young girl that he hold on and take her from, it is said that she's 10 years old. So, he's now wanted by the police. Last on the list is Lex Roy Vas. He's popularly known as Lex. Now, Lex, he's 25 years old and he's from Well Lane, Sandy Bay, in the parish of Hanover. Lex, he was being held in custody by the police on some serious charges. But he escaped police custody at the Barney Street Police Lockup. On Valentine's Day, the 14th of February 2020. Since then, the police have been trying to find him, but they can't. So the list of names are just released. If any of you is on this list, go give up yourself to the police. You, the wider public, if you know anybody on this list, they are wanted by the police. And also, harboring a fugitive is a criminal offense. Blessed love, everybody.